Hey guys, it is Andre, and today I am coming at you with a haul. I actually think I might have just formatted my card and deleted a bunch of things instead of just deleting the last clip, but whoops. Um, I did do like a whole full intro, but this is kind of like, I'm going to probably call it like a friends haul. I do get like a ton of things at conferences. Sometimes I do de-stash before I take it home. I honestly didn't have any more room. Like if I would have had one more sticker sheet, I wouldn't be able to close my suitcase. So I tried to give it to planner girls at the event that who might have room in their suitcase or be able to use the items, um, like some TNs and things like that. Cause I'm not using TNs right now. Um, and things of that nature, but this is friends items. I don't show everything that I got from the conference just because then it becomes like, here's this, here's this, here's this, here's this. Some things that I got from men's I already did put away, but mid putting it away, I was like, I should probably do a haul. So I'm gonna just show you the things here. I did receive other items. I did keep a lot of items. And like I said, some I gave to planner girls at the event that I met or, you know, know from meeting at other events and things like that. Um, I have a lot of planner stuff, so obviously I don't need it all so I like sharing the love but there is a lot of good stuff here I am doing a vlog I don't know if it'll be up before this or after this but you can go ahead and check that out to see what table I sat at which I sat at the queen peas table which I already put my peas away but I do have a couple of things from the table that I didn't put away before realizing I should probably film this so um, I sat at her table it was amazing I'm actually wearing my ears if you guys saw the video or you're going to see the video, I got these at the table. It was my favorite thing that I got from the whole conference. So thank you, Cindy, from the Queen P. So let's go ahead and get into the haul. I don't really know where to start, so I'm just going to start on the very top here. So actually, I don't even think I opened this yet. There's a couple things that I haven't opened. Um, like, I don't think I opened this. I didn't really look at this. There's, there's stuff everywhere. Um, but this is from Amanda from the Fox and Pip, and I am so excited that I got to meet her. It was my first time meeting her and also Rachel from Pigtails and Pockets and a lot of other people as well. I'll talk about them as I as I get to them. Um, I actually put a bunch of stuff in here. So actually some of this is, I, I had to really condense to get everything into my suitcase. Okay, so this was what was in the bag. First of all, the bag is so cute. I love her bow. You guys know whenever I do my hauls and I buy her vinyls, I usually buy two or three of them at least just so I always have one to hoard and then one to use, but she was so sweet and so cute. So this is the bag. Um, and then inside of it, there were these super cute post-its. They are like um, galaxy themed. And then this one says mistletoe notes. I believe this is just Sunny's handwriting. And then these are her... Um, they're kind of like, I think like a, supposed to be like an open TN look, so that's super cute. And also, even still this, I do go through this, and you know, if there's something that I'm like, you know, Kirsten or Emily or Jessica might use it more than I would, I, I gift it to them. Just because, you know, it's nice to receive all of these items, but it's, it's even nicer that sometimes, like, being able to give them to other people who you know would use them and love them. So... That's something to also like remind you guys that I know a lot of girls do that too. If they have something that, you know, maybe like let's say these gift tags, I already have some, but I know Emily could use them. I would gift them to her and she would appreciate them. So this is the journaling card. It is so cute. I love the marble. I love what like when she did her little rebrand with like all the marble and the pink. It is very, very cute. And then there is this little sampler here, which is so cute. This literally looks exactly like Amanda. So this is like her little thank you for meeting me or like so nice to meet you little sampler. And I did go to hers and Rachel's oh these are nice I feel like these are different paper than the one she sent me but um I did go to her and Rachel's little um they did like a workshop and it was so fun so these are the foiled bow headers she did send me some of these before and I did use them I thought they looked adorable in my little um actually I have it right here in my Thumbelina I used it as a like double-sided bookmark but these are so cute. So she gave me the ones in hollow, rose gold, gold, and then this really gorgeous rainbow foil. Love that. So thank you, Amanda. And then I did get some stuff from Pigtails and Pockets. So she did give me this pouch. I don't know if there's something in it. If there is, we'll get to it. Um, but this is super cute. It's Hello Kitty. And then it has a little A, which I do have a bunch of these from Amanda. And they are super cute. Um, then I did get some stuff from Mommy Light. I think I put the rest of it away already. But these are die cuts. And she gave away a ton of stuff. I think it was at our table. And then she also gave away a TN at the event. And then I have the 
what is this called the key card which was uh sponsored by the planner society christy so cute um and then we're gonna do a lot of and then i think i have stuff from annie i'll probably just start pulling from the top because i know there's like multiple things from people like deep in here you know so annie gave us these super cute little notepads i think yeah they're notepads with a little bear on the bottom some journaling cards so i probably will give one of these to emily because she really likes nautical stuff and then these really cute foiled stickers that are happy scrappy collabs so you have messy bun and getting stuff done and then you have some headers in pink and then gold then i have these gift tags from once more with love which i i'm probably actually going to keep these i know i said before i was like well somebody could use them but i'm going to keep these because i am using them for journaling there was this sparkly paper coat sampler in something i got a winter planner land um pin and also a washi um and also where i know there's something else with this one i did get this booklet here well not a booklet it is a sticker album and it is from golden plans co which she actually gave these as well and she gave me a couple extra to you know if anybody else wanted one which was super nice of her so I think everyone you know either took a washi or a pin so she gave me this adorable which this is our collab so we did do she did the girls and then I did a kit using the girls which was so fun and I told her we need to do a collab maybe in the spring or the summer but Golden Plants Co she is a sweetheart and she gave me an album with a bunch of sticker sheets in them so I have different girls and I think she did like the like fairish skin with the brown hair for all of them so these are super cute and I definitely can use those and the album so cute and it says best friends forever um I also got these I don't remember if these were on the table maybe and then I took Marg's too possibly so this is a hot cocoa spoon with caramel I've been obsessed with those those are from Target um you can get a ton of like hot chocolate additives at Target uh, I think maybe Marg said she didn't like caramel so I took those um um, then I have some stuff from um, Amanda and Rachel's little workshop. There was another piece, but it was like big and I couldn't fit it in the um, in the bag. But they did a workshop on how to um, turn die cuts into different things, which was really useful. Um, and there was also like a vellum, but I gave that to Lauren of Rose Color Days and she's going to foil it for me because I'm terrible at foiling things. So there is this die cut of some munchkins and then there is a little sticker sheet with kind of like collabs there. And then there is a bunch of die cuts in this pack. So that's super cute as well. I got this little sampler from Malika's Planner and oh, yeah, Malika's Planner and it's a My Nose Addiction little collab and she's super cute. I liked her a lot. And I did get a Starbucks gift card and a super cute little ornament from my friend Amy. Hi, Amy, if you're watching. I love you. And then I also have a bunch of seals here. I have these ones from Irene. So I took two of those. Super cute. Of the hollow with the rainbow tie-dye. And then there were a bunch at the Box and Pip and um, Pigtails and Pockets workshop so I have a bunch of the ones that they were giving out I have one of the bracelets from wonton and a million I already have this one so I'm going to give that to somebody I was giving out these samplers so one of them just slipped into this like I said this wasn't very much organized at all this is something that I think I don't remember if it was on the table or not but this is tipsy dog designs and I really loved this sticker so I think I took Marg's as well. I just thought it was really, really funny. So I have those. Then I have this, which is a card from Cynthia. She wrote me a really cute note on the back. Then I think this is my order from Once More Love. We'll see that to last. That's like, or maybe I'll actually, I'll put this in my, um, my haul because technically I ordered those. So do I have a haul pile? Those are here. I have, a, I have like seven haul piles. Um, then I, oh, this is also from Annie. I knew there was more stuff from Annie. So this is a little pouch and she put a little vinyl that says Andrea on it and I believe it is in her handwriting. And then inside of it there, oh my God, there's another one of these pens. <gasps> oh, so we, I have one more for my collection. This one's Sam, sent me from Happy Scrappy. So this is super cool that I have another one. I'm gonna put it right with that one. Those are so fun. And then in here, there is a 3D gemstone for a pop socket. So I think you can just put this on the like flat pop socket. And then Andrea in a hot pink foil, which is so cute. I have an idea where I'm gonna put that. A Starbucks coffee little clip and then a hollow well, it's just hollow. It's not hollow silver. It's hollow, um, or like, I guess like a blue 
like shift I, I'm trying to get like the hollow duo like shift like the lingo down um snowflakes so that's super cute and I have a place for that as well then I have some stuff here from Tabitha which I got to meet which I was so excited from no white space stickers I'm kind of a fangirl tbh because I'm kind of obsessed with her stories I love her like intense energy she has like a really like high level of energy and I'm like kind of super drawn to it so she did give me one of her pins which I actually think I'm going to give this to Emily because Emily is so obsessed with sloths so she is going to love that and then maybe this too honestly Emily is like this one I'm going to keep because this is just like pink but I feel like Emily's going to love the sloth stuff like honestly like this is all like so Emily I feel like this package is made just to go to Emily but this is so cute I mentioned before I'm not like the biggest fan of the sloths. I like her other kits. She does like photo kits. She does um, like Disney kits. Um, but this is a super cute. I think Emily would love this. But it's so sweet. And she does like premium matte. She does foil. She's super picky about her foil. Um, so her foil is always perfection. And like I said, I, I do have some of her other kits. I have some of her Disney ones. I used her Haunted Mansion one in my planner. It was actually one of the first kits that I've used from another shop in a really long time. Um, it kind of invigorated me to kind of start branching out and using other kits again, but super cute. So thank you, Tabitha, and it was so nice to meet you if you are watching. Um, so that is that. Emily's gonna, Emily's gonna poop her pants. Literally poop her pants. Um, then I have some stuff from Jessenia. She actually made me an ornament, but I already went ahead and hung it somewhere. No, Jessenia, I did not put it on my tree. I know that you have faith in my child, aka your cat, but I'm not, I, I put it in my office and it's like right here. Um, I have an arm that holds my camera and I put it there because I think that I want to see it all year round. And she made an ornament. It's like an opalescent clear ornament with my name on it on vinyl in white and then there's a feather inside and it has a really pretty like shabby chic can't think of what the fabric's called but it's like a torn pink like ribbon it's really pretty but Jessenia and Maria did do a live plan with me Maria's was actually planning and Jessenia's was setting up a TN and she set up her TN using the Jessenia TN kit which I did supply for everyone at the event so everyone got the full kit which I was so excited about and she did do a swag like for everyone as well and it was this gorgeous journaling card and it's in pink it says believe in your dreams with the little dots and the um, bows which you could totally use this in any setup and then she also did do an insert which is so awesome I think you guys should comment down below if you think Jessenia should do her like top best-selling inserts and like print them because they're awesome the paper is super soft and it's just so nice and this is the cover matches the art of the TN kit and then she was giving out these like handing them out and these are so gorgeous I had to grab two and they have um like a little journaling card, a washi card, a pen, and then a mug. And it is foiled on the front and back because Jessenia is extra like that. Then I do have some stuff from Maria from Two Little Bees. I actually have two little packages. This is the swag that she gave out for her plan with me, which she did an amazing job. She is so funny, like literally so funny. Um, but this is like a little mini kit that she used to plan. There is a foil sampler in here from Rose Colored Days, which is in um, hollow foil. So you had some headers, you had a Winter Planner Land box in hollow. I wish I was using a hollow kit this week. And then you have some flags. There's a little die cut that says Winter Planner Land on it, which was really cute. And then there is a Simply Gilded little bow there as well. And then, like I said, Maria did give me some other stuff. Most of this stuff was gifted to me from my friends like directly but some of it it was like swag so trying to kind of differentiate that so she did I didn't actually didn't open this yet she just like threw this at me last night and I was like what is this and she's like for you <gasps> little bow Kate Spade earrings Maria also was decked out in pink or buffalo check and bows so girl was was on like on point when it comes to planner girl style um, so these are some journaling cards. You have this one, which is super cute, Christmassy, Valentine's Day, and then this is a Valentine's Day kit. It's mixed with photos and clip art. So this is, I believe, a mini kit. So you have your boxes, and then you have some washi flags, deco. Oh, these are so funny. Some headers, and then you have some half boxes, flags, 
boxes and then this bottom washi is super cute and you have some headers on the side so that is adorable thank you maria i'm so excited um then i have some stuff oh i think mark's stuff's mostly in there i have some stuff from paper and milk denise who is a, a sweetheart she's also super funny so there is this one which says coffee thoughts i'm actually give this one to jessica i'm gonna put that one over there and then this one says today which i'm keeping that on and then this one says today as well which is, is adorable i really love that and then there is a little die cut actually this might be a sticker and this is a sticker and then she did include three really cute little sticker sheets. So I actually didn't order these because I was slacking. So I'm really excited to have these because her stickers are nice because I feel like they're like neutral enough. Bubba's tired if you can't hear that. Um, but they're neutral enough that you could totally use them in any spread, I think. Um, and they look super cute. Let me try and get my stuff together. So I do have some stuff here from rose colored days i have two i don't remember i think this might have been what she was giving away to like anyone who came up to her and i think this might have been like specifically like a me like me swag you know what i mean um so this has her little journaling card yeah i'm thinking this is what she gave out to everyone this is like again foil on both sides because she's extra and then there is a bow clip in white which is super cute and then this one is a transparent overlays with her new glitter and i was like lauren you need to do this in glitter 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 we need to see this in glitter so hopefully she has a lot more glitter items coming and then there is a really cute journaling card that is pink with rose gold and it has hearts and gingerbread on it which is super cute and I am going to be saving this cello because again she is extra and has custom printed cellos I can't keep up here then what we go to next I think we oh there's more rose card days so this is the stuff that she gave me she's my I I have adopted her as my big sister I'm keeping that one too um I've adopted her as my big sister so hi big sister if you're watching um this is a pink glitter a gold glitter I took the outside of this off because I like messed it up and then there is an Andrea in vinyl it's like a pink it's really pretty pink it's kind of like a muted pink and then some confetti dots I don't know if you can see these confetti dots and these silver glitter so super cute and then she did give me an well I demanded she gave me four of her confetti tape so she gave me the I think she gave me the gold and the rose gold and I was like what about silver and hollow I was just being a jerk but then she was like you use uh, gold and rose gold and I was like what I use rose I use gold and silver so she so kindly went and got me the other ones we're we're jokesters and I, I love Lauren she's so funny but it was it was just an experience you know and then she also gave me this um pouch which is actually really cute i might i'm gonna think i might use this for but i'm gonna i'm gonna save that yet and then there is a metal shape stuff a metal shape sticker in a gold heart and then also a oh, i guess some actually might be rose gold and then a gold bow clip which is super dang cute and these pens are from mommy lay they're super cute. I think I'm going to gift this one. Actually, I actually might gift both of these to Emily because I feel like, again, she really loves rose gold. Actually, I might keep one for my setup. Yeah, I might keep one of these for my setup. But I'm going to give the other one to Emily. And then I got a little juniper bunny, which is so cute, from Irene. And it is uh, rose gold. Then I have some stuff from Carolyn. I think that there's other things in here that are also I don't I didn't even like look in here to even start putting this away so I don't know what's in here I got some stuff from Carolyn I think there might be some more stuff in my backpack though because I was wearing the other ring and I don't know where it went but this was this super cute little pouch that me and Patty were like oh my goodness you could do so many things with this so love that then I have these charms which are super cute should I open these yes I should so she gave me I think rings I think she knows what I'm doing here. And I love Carolyn. I think she's like, she's on my level. Like, I really, I really feel like we get each other. You know what I mean? She's so cute. So there are, this one which is a snowflake, which looks so cute with the Jesenia Tian kit. And then this one is pink. And it has a moon and stars. And the moon has a bow. Oh my god, dead. 
and then this one is a little bow which will go with everything and then she did she was doing like jewelry so she did give me this bow ring which is super cute and gold and then I know she gave me another ring too but I don't know if it's in here or maybe in here I haven't gone through those yet but another thing that I got from the event, which I think is really funny, it's kind of like a memory, you know what I mean? This is the Naughty or Nice Santa. So my camera died, but I got to like organize things. So I did find my um, little name tag, which is like a sparkly name tag. And it says Andrea Brady, which is not my name. It's Andrea Rivert. But that is okay. And it came on like a little um, lanyard. And then this was a pin that we got from the event. This is another clip. I think this is from Carolyn. I told you everything's everywhere. I already put away a lot of stuff and some stuff I like to, I didn't even know where it was. And I found the ring too. So this is a little clip. So it has a little like fuzzy ball and then a bow. Go ahead and zoom you all in. And then this is what the, the, the like ring one, the, I think the bow ring came in this one, which is a little macro, which I'm totally going to keep that super cute, but cute for pills when traveling. And then this was the other ring, which I think I'm going to give to Emily. I don't even know if she wears rings, but is this not the most Emily thing that you've ever seen? A rose gold star and moon um, little ring. She definitely needs that. We're going to put this over here. Um, then, oh, there's a palm from Peach Palm. She also gave me stickers, but I already put those away. But again, I think I'm going to give this to Emily because it's rose gold and she's obsessed. And then there is some stuff from Mandy from Mandy Dreams, Mandy Plans. And these are her little squiggly heart arrows in silver gold and then a light gold. And then there is a little um, like sampler. And then I didn't bring home any food besides these because Mandy knows what's up. These are fire. These are amazing. I love these. I love the, what's it, chua? But they have like a potato chip one, and that's what my love started from. I also found this. I think this might have been from Pigtails and Pockets as well. And this has the Fox and Pippo, which is so dang cute. Then I have some stuff from Cloth and Paper, which is at the Queen Peas table. I don't know why I didn't put this one in. I think it was because it was in one of the boxes. Um, but this, there's like a journaling card, another journaling card. And then there were like a memo pad, but this was like really cool. It was like, it's like super high quality. I don't even know what this is. Super high quality and it's like so modern and chic. And then memo random and then I don't even know what this is. Sticky notes, fall winter 2018 sticky notes issue one volume two. I don't know. It's just really fancy, you know what I mean? Then I have some stuff from Patty from Planning Fancy, who I love. She does like the most intense setups and she set like everyone up. Um, that stayed at the houses, one of these planners, and they are intensely amazing. I'm 100% not going to use this and just like cherish it because I don't want to mess it up. But like, she went all in, you know what I mean? Like, she put inserts in here, she put vellum, acetate, made dashboards. Like, do you see this? This just needs to go in like a glass container with like an up light you know what I mean so this is beautiful she even put like a little gem here but I'm gonna save this forever so thank you Patty it's gonna go somewhere and be displayed she also got me these super cute pins they're gold and they have the most pretty like not neon but like brighter colors on them those are so cute she also got me this like lipstick which is so cool it's like it looks like a little pill and then whenever you open it it's so glittery but so fun so super excited about that I'll probably just wear it like around the house tbh and it smells really good and then she also got me one of these super cute pencil cases and it has like glitter in it how cool is that i think people use them to put their pins in i do have some stuff from irene from simply gilded she did give me a blanket which obviously i can't show in the video and then also these m cosmetics lip gloss she said these are her favorite lip glosses and i'm really excited to try them the packaging is really really pretty so there's that and then I did get a couple, just a couple of washies, you know, just a couple. Irene spoiled us and set up like a little washi bar in the house and let us pick whatever washies we wanted. So she was very, very generous. So I did pick up my favorites. There's was, there was a lot of other ones as well, but I just wanted to pick up a couple of them. So I did pick up, wait, what did I do here? Oh, okay. So I did pick up, um this juniper bunny that is pink with a really pretty gold which is super pretty and cute this one which is the skinny with the hollow stars and moons this one's the skinny it's like a gray scale with hollow 
and then the two new mixed metals this is silver blue and then a blue background and this one is rose gold oh, it's like a silver hollow with a purple um, this one is a confetti with silver and gold, silver and gold on white and black, which I really like the setup of this one. Really cool. Um, then this was the, like, I don't know if this is an exclusive or just unreleased for, it kind of runs with the cotton candy one. And this was the, like, it was like swag. So she also had the bigger one. So I picked out this one. I really like that variation. Um, you know, I'm not crazy about like making sure I need all the variations. And then there were two rainbow ones i'm not sure if i have this one or not already it's like a champagne with gold with a rainbow and then this is a really bright rainbow one and then it has hollow bows um this one and that one and then i also got this one which is rainbow with silver and gold so it's one another one of those mixed metals ones and then i was so psyched about these these are the vertical bows in silver and gold with pink and blue so super psyched about these um, and then she also had a bunch of extra and was like if you guys want to take anything else so i did um take this for emily and then this for kirsten i feel like those were good picks for them then i have some stuff here from wonton in a million cynthia always spoils us so she did give me a 2019 calendar which I'm super excited about because my 2018 one is obviously almost empty and she gifted me that one too and I just really love those and thank you to look at every month this was the swag for Cynthia's workshop which was amazing she did a talk on how to do like a project in 365 days so all of her orders always come with this card and then I have another one of these crazy rich dumplings which I'm going to definitely save um this was part of the um project so the 365 day project there were some vinyls in here which I think I have all of these but I do use them to like decorate things so I'm definitely going to be keeping those and then there were some stickers in here as well which there is the you can do it this one is Lazy Day, which with the sloth, which I sent a picture of this to Emily when I opened it. It was like, oh, dumpling tracker. That's funny. I didn't even realize it was a tracker. Steamy boxes and suey boxes, as well as two washies. So this is, you know, the wonton making or the dumpling making. And then this one is the um, steamy eating dumplings, which I was like, this is cannibalism. But I thought it was funny. So then I was so psyched about this. <clears throat> This was what my pen came on. So this is, let's get over here. So this is the uh, Sui's Naughty List and Steamy's Nice List, which is really funny. Um, some more of those gift tags. Some of these, I actually used these in my December Daily. The foiled um, seal stickers. And then I also have some of these, which are so cool. Um, I love these little best friends. I'm like most psyched about this. If you know me, I, lo I love Toy Story. So these are little calendar cards. So how cute are these? They have like different friends up top. So cute. I was like, who's this? And she's like, Calvin Hobbs, Hobbs, Hobbs. And I just have no idea who this is, but I thought it was really cute. I was like, oh, it's a tiger and Santa. And she's like, no, not quite. Um, then there is some washi, which I think I might have some of these, but I'm not totally sure. I feel like I ordered some of them. So this one is a really cute, like, Christmas scene, which is super cute. I think this might be a Once More With Love collab, maybe? I thought I saw a... Uh, oh, no, maybe. Yeah, that looks like a... It looks like a munchkin. Super cute. And then there's this one, which is a New Year's Eve one. Some black with gold hearts. And I love the foil she picked. Um, this one is a black foil, which is really cool. Because um, she picked, like, this one has, like, stars. Um, and this one's just, like, really cool, like, confetti bits. And this one's pink with um, snowflakes. So it's super cute. And then last but not least, I do have this box from Marg, which was a, like, honorary bridesmaids box, which is kind of funny. Um, I am going to Marg's wedding, and Bennett's going to be the ring bearer, which I just think is so cute. When she asked me, I was like, oh, yes. Um, but I told her a long time ago, but I don't think even before she was, like, talking about her wedding, I was like, yeah, I do not want to be a bridesmaid, like, ever. I'm like, it's just so, like, complicated, and I feel like it depends on, like, who you're, um, who you're, I mean, you guys know, there's just, like, I've had bad experiences, I feel like, with, um, wedding parties, so I was like, I'm just kind of retired from the game, so she asked me her to be her bridesmaid in spirit, which I still told her I'll do whatever she needs me to do, so I'm probably going to do most of her bachelorette party planning. I'm so excited, but I wanted to keep 
the box with the note on it. Um, but it was funny because I, this was on the top, and I flipped the lid open, and I was like, oh, and she's like, you didn't read the box. And I was like, because I just saw this, I was like, that's so cute. And I closed the lid, and I was like, I don't read French. And she was like, no, the inside. And I was like, oh, and I saw the inside, and I was like, I thought that was just like, some kind of like poem or something they put inside the box but yes this is really cute i'm gonna put it in my office and then she gave me this little tray this was kind of like a like brides made gift so this was all like included in that it's all kind of like beauty stuff so i don't know if you guys really care and a bracelet um but there are these super cute little um mini and mickey inspired munchkin pens this felt um bookmark which is so cute um then she gave me a bunch of these red um Red bows from Simply Gilded, which I'll probably see if any of my friends want the extras. And then there is this one, which is her collab with Simply Gilded. My camera couldn't have gave me two more minutes. So this is the collab with Simply, Simply Gilded and Once More Love with the gray to the pink ombre. There are these super cute little clips, which are so cute. I just want to squeeze them. And then there is a enamel pin. I might have this one ready. I'm not sure. I have to look around. I feel like I have a lot. Maybe I actually don't have this one. We'll see. But it's super cute. And then I have, oh my goodness, the ears fell again. I have some washi cards with the, um, wrong way. <clears throat> Is that right way? Yeah. So they have the munchkins, the castle, and the magical on the top. And then this one is so funny. Oh, wait, let's see. This is a oops journal card, but it's so funny and cute. And this is one to my on the bottom. And then there is this, which was swag, I think. And they're just like the foldovers. And then this was, um, I think some of her new releases. So these will be in my haul too. But this is the year of the pig for Lunar New Year, which is so dang cute. Definitely have to use those. And then the Snuggle Time stickers, the All You Need Is Love stickers. Emily ordered 10 of these, which I think is funny even. So Emily told me, and then Marg also told me as well, which I think is funny. Convention bucket list stickers, which are super cute. And then there are these, which I, I am so excited about which because I formatted this I helped Mark format all of her foil sheets and I was just like seeing them in real life I get like so excited like it's just so like cool seeing all the munchkins and foil so this was her Black Friday freebie these are her headers her bow headers in gold and then these are full boxes I thought these would be really cute to uh, incorporate into spreads like maybe put one in like every hollow spread you do and just have like a little munchkin peeking so I thought that's adorable and then I have some weekend banners and then these are super cute they just remind me of me and Jessica like literally me and Jessica or actually you know I'm actually thinking this one might be me and Lauren Lauren if you're watching that's me and you but this one's me and Jessica full show and this one's how I feel whenever I think of Bubba so cute so really excited about those so that's everything I'm not gonna pull everything back in for a shot but thank you for everyone who gave me something, even if I didn't show it. I really appreciate it. And everyone who donated to the tables and the swag. Um, it was just a really good event. And I'm really excited for my next event, which is Chicago. Um, if you're going to Chicago, let me know in the comments down below. After that, I'll be going to PlannerCon. So I'm really excited about that as well. I've never been to San Francisco, so really pumped. Um, otherwise, I hope you guys like this video. And I'll talk to you guys in my next. Oh, and then look at this. I had the rose gold one, which by itself, it doesn't look like super rose gold, but once you like stack them, they look definitely like rose gold. But Annie thought that these were Cartier bracelets, but they're not. They're just super shiny, simply gilded bow bracelets. And I've been wearing the rose gold one. I haven't taken it off yet. It's been like a month and it's, it's been shower, sleep, and there's been no like green. It hasn't tarnished or anything. So in case you were wondering, and they're so fabulous. So Irene did such a good job with these. She is a creative genius, but let's talk about that in another video. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Okay, so we're doing Advent. It's going to kind of be a little bit on the rapid fire side. Today's going to be a little bit longer because I am doing like kind of intros. We already have obviously the Giving Girl and then mine and Once More With Love collab Advent. But I do have four other Advents here to show you guys. So these two were sent to me. I feel like I have another one, but maybe not. Um, and then I also have this one, which is the Ultimate Planner Advent Calendar, which I am in. And I did purchase this one. And then I also have the Simply Gilded Advent Calendar. Hold on, let me turn that off. Um, 
which mine today is the 11th mine actually shipped yesterday so I don't have it so Brian was coming over to my house for something and Kirsten was like well if you want mine you can just have mine and then whenever yours come in we'll just switch so thank you Kirsten for switching me because I needed to film these because well I can't really I can't really tell you why I'm, um, I'm filming them early but um, just know that I had to film them today so um, the rest of them have been here for a minute so let's go ahead and get into these so I'll just work from this way over so like I said I'm going to do this a little more rapid fire actually let's do the ones that we already um, know first so this one is Maya and Once More With Loves and I keep saying I cannot wait to get this all finished so that I can put stickers in here I'm trying to figure out what I want to put in here but I have like a couple of options so this day actually has two items in it so this is day I don't know. We'll find out when we get in here because it has numbers on it. But this is the journaling card. So it says top knots and coffee. There is a foiled bookmark that says fall in love. We're in the fall section. And there also is a really pretty vinyl, clear vinyl bow sticker. Uh, this is an unreleased um, design as everything is in here. And it is black outline with glitter. How cool is that? So I really think this would be neat to put over anything like let's say put it over red it becomes red with glitter on it so super fun um i have some other colors coming to the shop with this one i think we used all of them in the advent so that is today for the spc once more with love advent and then we have i put all my stuff like in the front here <clears throat> and then today is day four day 14 um maybe i'll do this one first actually every day so that i can i can know when i'm like editing these what days it is this is day 14 of the Giving Girl Advent Calendar. So, uh, let's see. So, it's day 14. Then we have these stickers. So, I think I had purple ones. These, honestly, it's been like 14 days since I've opened any of these. I opened them all in bulk just because of how I'm editing all these videos. Um, I needed to pre um, um, film them, which is what I'm doing now. Um, so, I have a little bow die cut here, which is on like the same paper. So, this is a super cute day. And I'm assuming this is like a freebie she's been putting in like every couple of days, like a little item as a freebie. So, that is my giving girl stuff. And I have been just putting all of my stuff like together um, for these two days. At least. I don't know if I'll do it for the rest of them just because I have a lot of advents now. Um, then next, I'm not, I'm kind of confused on if I open one first. I think so. There was one, this one had them like stacked, so I was assuming they worked their way down. It says, this is day two first. Mm, do I not have a day one in this one? Uh, okay, well, I don't have a day one in that one, so that's weird. So let's go ahead and just open this one. So this one is a... What is this store? Butterfly Planner. Start opening your presents on December 13th. Da, 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 da. And then it comes with a little freebie that is like open which day. So this is day one. So it comes in like a little bag. And then these are some cat stickers. So those are cute. So you put that up there. Then I have an advent calendar from... There's like a really cool Hogwarts seal. I think this, I'm in this one as well. So this one is, let me put this up. So there was a like Deathly Hallows pin on the top. I'm assuming that's like an extra freebie. Um, Hogwarts will always be there to welcome you home. Journaling card. And then there is a piece of paper. Is there anything important in here? No. Um, from Creativity and Ink. So this is like your advent calendar information. Um, I feel like I might be opening these the wrong order, so I'm like really bummed. Like I want to know what was in day one of the Hello Symbol paper one. And I just opened it out of the box, so it couldn't have gotten lost. Um, so this is day one of the Creativity and Ink one. So there is a charm here, which is, let's open it up. So this, this one was sent to me, and I am in it. This one is a bookmark, I think. It's a little on the tangled side. I'll untangle that later, but it is a bookmark with a deer on it. And then there is, which this is so exciting, is a die cut pack from Jessica. Jessica does digital. I'm trying to convince her to do some physical items, and I'll help her do it. Um, but this is a, a physical item from Jessica, but this is some um, die cuts on really, really glossy papers. Is this sticker paper? Oh, these are stickers. 
I don't even think Jessica knew this. But they're stickers. I'll have to like text her and let her know. So these are die cut stickers and they are on a super glossy paper. It's almost like a vinyl, I think, but not a vinyl. I don't I don't think it's a vinyl. Um, but these are, I think, all exclusive designs for this advent, and that's so cool that they're stickers. I really don't think Jessica even knew that. So um super excited about that. Then we'll go. I can't show you guys the um Hello Symbol paper one because I don't have day one. I don't know. I really don't know what happened there. But like I said, I just took it out of the box like 10 seconds ago, so I couldn't have misplaced it. But um, then I have my um, Assembly Guild one, which like I said, this is actually Kirsten. So thanks, Kirsten. You need a bomb. Um, but let me go ahead and find day one. These are all really beautifully wrapped. This is like some dedication here with the wrapping in these bags, which I don't think I'm going to keep the bags with juniper seals and the first day looks like it's washi so this is it actually matches the box so this is a floral washi with a champagne bow that is super cute and you did get a 15 millimeter and a 10 millimeter in there and i think that's everything for this day of the